In this video, I'm going to show you how to build an AI agent that can automatically draft LinkedIn posts for you based on your content ideas in your actual voice. It's pretty cool. So let me show you the setup first. I have a spreadsheet here where in column A, I'm going to put a content idea, could be one or two sentences. And then in column B, I'm going to have the AI put in a LinkedIn post draft. And I'm going to use a relay.app AI workflow to achieve that. So first, I'm going to add a trigger that whenever a new row is added to that Google Sheet, which is the LinkedIn drafts from content ideas sheet, I'm going to do the following things. First, I'm going to automatically fetch my recent posts from LinkedIn so the AI will know what my voice and my style is and what posts have performed well in terms of engagement. Then I'm going to pass the content idea and my historical LinkedIn posts into an AI step for it to draft a new post based on that, and then I'm going to write it back into the spreadsheet. Let me show you how to do that step by step. So first, I need to go to LinkedIn and I need to get my posts. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to type LinkedIn and you'll see an option that says get LinkedIn person activities from URL. And the URL you need to put in is the URL of your LinkedIn profile. Let me go quickly find the URL of my LinkedIn profile. There we go. There's me. Um, and I'm going to put that into the profile URL field. If no activities are found, we can fail. It should really find some activities because I post a lot on LinkedIn. Then the next thing we're going to do is write an AI step. And in this case, I'm going to use a custom prompt AI step. So I'm going to go to the AI menu. I'm going to select prompt any model, and I'm going to write the following instructions. Given this content idea, and then to include the content idea, I'm going to press the at sign, and that's going to let me reference the content from the spreadsheet row that triggered this workflow. I'm going to select content idea. So given this content idea, please write a linked uh, in post in my writing style based on the following posts. Try to follow the voice and pattern of my posts that have gotten the most engagement. And then I'm going to attach the activities retrieved from the previous step. Those are all my recent posts, and that's going to include all the engagement on top of those. And the output in this case I just want is text. I want to get a LinkedIn post in text. Um, and then once I have that LinkedIn post, all I need to do is write it back to the spreadsheet. And the way I'm going to do that is with an update row step. And the row I'm going to update is, well, the one that I triggered this workflow based on. And the field I'm going to update is the LinkedIn post draft. And I'm going to pass in the output of the previous AI step. And the way I'm going to do this, I'm going to press the plus button on the right. I'm going to select the AI output. So now I have a complete workflow ready to go. Let's turn the trigger on and then I'm going to put in a content idea and let's see what it does. So I'm going to turn the trigger on and then I'm going to go over to my spreadsheet and I'm going to put in a content idea. Like let's say uh, I built an AI agent to automatically write LinkedIn posts for me based on content ideas. Okay. Now let's see what kind of LinkedIn post that the AI produces for me. And so uh, I can uh, make this trigger check. It would have taken a few minutes if I, if I had just waited, but it would have worked automatically. And now you can see the run is in progress. So it's now fetching my recent posts from LinkedIn. This usually takes about 30 seconds. Okay, it found my LinkedIn posts. And if you click into activities, you can see that it found 50 recent posts all of the things I've done. So here's a post I made yesterday, and you can see how many reactions and comments it got. Um, so there's pretty robust information about my LinkedIn posts. And now it's passed that into the AI step, which is going to use that as background information to write a new post. Let's see how it does. Okay, the AI is done. Let's check our spreadsheet and see what it made. So here's the LinkedIn post. Excited to share a tool I just built using related app that I'm now using across all my LinkedIn engagements with a rapid pace of blah, blah, blah. And you can see that it kind of tries to follow my style. I like to write four simple bullet points and give some examples, put in a couple emojis. It's not perfect though. It includes a bunch of hashtags. The tone is a little bit over, over the top. The voice isn't exactly right for me. So let me show you how I'm going to go back and tweak that to make it better. I'm going to do two things. One is I'm going to switch to a more advanced model that I think is going to be better at writing. And then number two is I'm going to give it some more information about how to write like me. So let me delete this and then go back to my workflow. I'm going to go into my AI 
And usually we try to pick the best fit model, but in this case, I want a really good model, a really good model for writing because I want it to sound like me. So I'm gonna pick Claude 3.5 Sonnet. And now I'm gonna give it some guidance, like don't use hashtags, don't use emoji, keep the language practical uh, and concise. Now let's see if it can do something a little bit more in my voice. So I'm gonna publish that. And now I don't need to go back and add a new row to the spreadsheet. I can just start a test run with that existing row that's already in the spreadsheet. Now we'll run it again. Okay, it's done. Let's go over to the spreadsheet and see how well it did. Okay, here's the new post. Just built a new AI agent automatically that automatically writes LinkedIn posts for me based on content ideas. And it actually works. Here's how it works. I feed it a one to Susan's content idea, and then it gives four bullet points. So this looks spot on. This is exactly my voice, exactly the kind of writing I like to do. Keep it concise, keep it practical. So the AI really adapted to my prompt and switching to the better model, Cloud 3.5 Sonnet, definitely helped too. So if you're ever feeling some writer's block and you want to quickly get a bunch of rough drafts of posts that you can work with to get up on LinkedIn, try out this, uh, try out this AI workflow and let me know what you think.